Hello YouTube, it's Kermie Bella. Um, I just wanted to come to you because I am doing a twist out. And this is um, my rendition of a dry twist out. This one isn't as dry or wasn't done on as dry hair as I normally do it uh, when I do this, but um, it, the hair was almost dry. Um, this weekend it was very hot and humid and I was sweating and my hair was taking forever to dry. So I figured since the weather's going to be like that, even though today it's a bright, sunny, warm day, um, I would put it in some twists so that you know, it wouldn't be as susceptible to the elements and I wouldn't have to wait all day for my hair to air dry. So anyway, this kind of gives you guys an idea of how fine my hair is. I mean, it's really not thick. I wish it was a little bit thicker, but, you know, whatever. Gotta love what you have. Okay, so what I'm going to do is, um, here's some, uh, what is this, tea tree oil. And I'm just going to put a couple drops in my hands. And then I'm going to smooth it over. And basically the way I do this uh, is I take um, I take uh, my wash and go and I slather it down with um, I take my dry wash and go like at the end of the day before I go to bed and I slather it down with gel I use echo styling gel of course with olive oil and um, then I twist my hair up and what it does is it seems to um, straighten my hair if that makes sense like when my hair's in the in the wash and go it's all curly and everything then when I put the gel on it it straightens it out and then I twist the almost straight hair. The only thing that's still kind of curly um, are my ends. And um, so it gives me a lot of uh, elongation. I won't have as much as I normally do with this because um, like I said my hair was still kind of wet which was the reason I thought about doing this in the first place. Um, So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys, this is how I take them out. I just twist them in the opposite direction that I twisted them up. And I leave them just at the two at first. And I'm not going to break these up right now. Whoops. I'm just going to take them out and then um, I'm going to pull them back. Because I'll show you my hair after I take these out. Um, it's very, very spacey. I mean, very, very spacey. There's no way in the world I could just take out some twists and go. No way. I'd look like who done it and why. Okay, so do I have any more? No. Yeah. No. Okay. Um, geez. It gets a little complex. Um, I hope everybody had a good Memorial Day. Mine was very relaxing. We actually celebrated the day before Memorial Day um, because my son wanted to go to a bonfire that his friends were were giving for Memorial Day so we cooked out uh, Sunday instead of yesterday so yesterday I, I pretty much just had a relaxing day but it was nice it was really nice
it was humid and rainy and muggy and all of that, but it was nice. Okay, so all of the twists are out. Okay, and I basically <laughs> this is itching my lip. I basically did them down on the sides. God, is there? They're not. Oh my gosh! Sometimes it's amazing, like how these twists kind of sneak up on you. You think you have them all out, and then you realize you don't. Okay, I'm probably because I'm rushing. All right, so everything appears to be out. Okay, so the way I did it was I braided it, you know, down on the sides and going towards the back and then like my middle area here, I just did in the middle. And I did this in the middle so that I could either do a side part or a middle part, whatever I wanted. Because I didn't, I couldn't figure it out yesterday, like what I was in the mood for. Okay, so this is, oh my gosh, <laughs> another one. All right, so this is my hair, okay, out of the twist. All right, so what I do to um, elongate them, now normally I would use one of those bands that uh, doesn't have a metal thing on it but today I'm using this because I can't find mine without the metal thing um, and the two that I could find were both like stretched out and I've been catching my hair on them um, and actually one day this week I was running a little bit late for work and I ended up having to cut a piece of my hair because my hair got stuck in it and I couldn't get the knot out okay so anyway um, then what I do is I don't, I don't pull them apart. This is for all you fine hair ladies and non-fine hair ladies, but you know what I mean. All right, so I don't pull them apart. Okay. And I just pull them up, pull them back. See? This, okay, no. And then I put them in a ponytail. Okay. And I leave it in a ponytail for as long as I can. There's a dog that lives next door who sits in the window. And then I don't know if he's watching me or what he does, but... You know, he'll come and he'll sit in the window and he'll look and then he'll run off and then he'll come. Anyway, I can hear his collar. So, um, anyway, so then I pull my hair in a ponytail. I leave it like this for a while. And then um, I take it down. And I'll come back in another video and show you guys how it looks um, down. All right. Ciao.